Hi guys, Steph here. Okie dokie, what have we got for you here? Can you recognise it? Oh no we can't. It's a lovely actually, this lovely suede case and if we open it up, there we go, a Schaefer. But what Schaefer is it? Well you'll look at it there you eagle eyed viewers and you'll recognise it straight away. What we've actually got here is a Schaefer snorkel fountain pen and pencil set. Now I've shown you lots of uh, Schaefer uh, <laughs> snorkel pens before. In fact I actually did one recently on the same model. A Schaefer snorkel. This is the special. Now there's just some slight differences. Hence the reason um, why I'd like to do this video. Plus we don't get them in sets that often. So I thought it'd be nice to show you. Let's first of all show you the instructions there we go we've got all the original instructions there how to well five easy steps for proper filling Schaefer snorkel pen that's what it says at the top uh, also the pencil there and ballpoint guarantee etc etc so let's pop that to one side and Let's look at the pen and the pencil. So let's take them out. Let's pop them on the side there. Now, as I say, what we've got is a Schaefer Snorkel Special Fountain Pen and Pencil. As I say, um, I don't like to repeat my videos, but just a slight little bit of difference on these. So I thought it'd be interesting just to share some information with you. First of all, let's have a look at the pencil there. Okay, straightforward pencil, um, cap act activated there. If we turn it, you can see, or oh, says he, there you go. You can see the lead coming in and out of the pencil, some slight knurling to the end there to give you a nice grip, quite a slim pencil, um, Schaefer's as you can see to the clip there, okay, um, what we'll actually do, pop that to one side, as you know I'm a fountain pen man so let's concentrate on the fountain pen, as I said I've shown you these lots of, lots of times, this is a Schaefer Snorkel Special, you'll notice it's a non-white dot model and this particular pen from around about 1950s, the size of it approximately from the cap to the bottom of the barrel 141mm, um, around about 11mm round the, round the barrel but the slight difference that I'd like to show you is, is the barrel imprint okay so let's keep that nice and still for you and what you'll notice the barrel imprint is slightly different on this one i.e. it says made in Australia WA Schaefer Pen Company let's maybe give you a little bit of a different angle let's show you once again, so as I say, made in Australia, WA Schaefer Pen Company. So that's the slight difference that the previous one that I've shown you was made in USA. Now, as far as I'm aware, the Schaefer snorkel pens were made in USA, maybe even Canada as well. Um, they were also made in the UK, and as this one, they were made in Australia. Now as far as I'm aware the made in Australia ones are slightly less common than the USA ones. They're, they're not by all means they're not rare pens but they are slightly less common the made in Australia snorkel pens. For you people that don't know as I say it's a snorkel pen it's got this blind cap this nail cap to the end of the barrel there. Um, you've got quite a large cap band there you can see quite a plain cap band. 
the very recognisable Schaefer clip to the very top and if we just bring it slightly closer you can see it says Schaefer's to the clip there. There's a sideways view for you. Let's undo the cap which is a screw on screw off cap. The pen and the pencil been fully restored, cleaned, all internally, new sack fitted, uh, new new washers etc etc. Now let's take you up to the section. You can see the section has got these sort of lines running out to make it a little bit nicer to grip. Now if you look at the nib there, the nib's slightly different than my previous one. In this particular case we've got a Schaefer Australia 14 carat number 5 nib. And as you can clearly see there, this is what we term as the open, open nib. As opposed to, well on some pens they've got the conical nibs. Now the previous special that I showed you not long ago had this conical nib. Um, these nibs are, are basically they're interchangeable so in some cases you may find the pen with the incorrect nib. It doesn't matter in my opinion it still works perfectly but this is the correct nib for this specific model. As we said there's a sideways view. Let's show you underneath there and there you can see the feed and you can see the snorkel just to the top of the feed there. Now one other difference on this pen, now if we unscrew the blind cap here and I'll be quiet okay I hope you could hear that slight clicking noise there and if we take you up to the snorkel again slight difference from my previous one you'll see that this particular snorkel you know it has a straight straight end as opposed to the slightly angled uh, version so the snorkels actually depend on the feed as I say this is the correct snorkel tube for this particular feed um, some of the feeds do accept the slightly angled or maybe is it a beveled maybe no that's not the right word but the, the slightly angled snorkel tube okay so you can see in this case it's just a sort of straight ended snorkel tube to the end there okay now what we do we pull out the well yeah the snorkel filler to the end there in fact what we're going to do in this case let's let's do a writing sample so to fill the pens I've told you lots of time we dip the snorkel tube in the ink push down on the filler here in one swift movement okay once we've done that we screw back the knob there you can see the snorkel tube goes back into the feed let's bring on some paper as always this is the first time the pen's actually been inked so let's see how it actually writes so what we have we have a Schaefer snorkel and this one being the special as we said we're dating it to dating it to the 1950s okay it's writing nicely I'm not going to ask whether there's actually any flex I do not expect it on this particular nib they don't tend to have any flexibility in the nibs but all in all as you can see it's writing nicely and as we said 
made in Australia. So let's pop the cap back on. Let's show you the writing sample there. As you can see, a lovely writer. I would say writing in a fine, fine line. So, actually what I'll also do, if I bring back the pencil, let's pop the lead out a little bit. There we go, you can see the pencil is in perfect working order as well. So let's leave it at that. So just slightly different, the reason for the video being that this is the Australian made uh, version of the Schaefer Snorkel special fountain pen and pencil. So I hope you've enjoyed looking at them as much as I enjoy showing them to you. Don't be shy, leave a comment down below and have you subscribed? If not, subscribe now. And don't forget people, please stay safe. But for now, I'll just say bye-bye for now.